I've never met the hat lady before. I should sometime. something pretty cool today the total package right here a 2002 GMC 2500 HD Duramax diesel 6.6 uh, it's got a CTS uh, attitude uh, edge performance uh, tuner that's up on the dash just a super nice uh, truck overall it's got 149,000 miles on it the gentleman that had it, uh, this was a friend of mine uh, that had it, and <clears throat> he thought he was going to do a lot of car hauling. He only hauled one car. Actually, it was down to me. And I actually hauled one car with it because when I went up and got it up in Portland, I hauled, uh, we took our uh, BMW X5, I drove it up there, put it in the trailer, and drove it here 60 miles. So. And it is just a Poland machine, so we just decided that we would sell it as a package. The trailer is a uh, 2018 Forest River Cargo Mate. It's 24 feet long and super, super nice. I'll open it up and uh, show it to you. Um, it also has a power jack, uh, LEDs, and, and everything. Uh, it's also got a winch. Um, just really nice. Tires are pretty new. On the truck i think they're 2016 uh allison transmission um if you already know the duramax trucks they're they're awesome trucks and uh, pretty sought after uh the guy did uh before my friend bought it he loved the truck and just did a ton of stuff uh to it in general so and kept it uh nice and clean uh it's even got power mirrors i'll show you so We'll just walk uh, from the front to the back. I wanted to uh, also say if you have something that you want us to help you sell and you don't mind us showing the goods and the bad, um, we don't like smoke and mirrors. Uh, we like people to know exactly what they're buying. That's why we've sold 221 cars on Bring a Trailer. Mostly no reserve, so Top Bid gets it. Um, it is fun uh, to watch the stuff, but it's nerve wracking at the same time. But let the market decide what it is. So it's not any fun to bid on anything if you can't actually win it. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the lights in general. You can see the marker lights work. And the gentleman that had it before added little lights in the dash. He kind of liked lights. And uh, we got uh, headlights, bright lights, turn signals. Got our left and we got our right. And then we got PIA, um, <clears throat> fog lamps up front and all that stuff uh, is working. Go ahead and show us the power mirrors. There's a little uh, switch on the, on, the, uh, on the door panel over there. You can see how they extend. I think they actually go out farther than that. Go ahead and go a little bit more. Keep on going. There you go. Those go out. That would go out pretty far. Um, just wanted to show you the paint. The paint is original. There's a lot of up here on the hood. There's a lot of little, little tiny touch-ups. Just little uh, touch-ups in general. Um, doesn't look bad when you get up close, though. You can see little tiny ones uh, here, um, kind of in the center. You know, quite a few right here. Just so you know that those are there. Uh, grill area looks really nice brush guard is nice as well uh, wheels and tires I have a receipt um, it's been sitting out in the rain so they actually do polish up you can see see here over the weekend it kind of rained on me but I want to get this video done you can see it's a 2016 is the date code they're Toyo uh, open countries and these are nice tires and I would say they're probably about 
probably 95% uh, tread on them. This is an SLT, so it is full leather and everything, uh, power seats. You'll see a little ding and a little uh, scratch right here that's been touched up. Uh, the rest of the paint up here looks really nice uh, in general. Um, the, uh, if we look back here, there's a bigger paint chip that's been touched up. Small little dent right there. Hopefully you can see that. Just a little tiny crease. I do have a dent guy. If you want, want before it leaves, he would make that look like it's not there anymore. Cost is going to be like 250 bucks. So if you want that done, um, hopefully you can see it right here. If you want that done, uh, he can do it uh, before we leave. You know, he, he can also probably take this one. The scratches will still be there, uh, but he could probably make that little ding um, smooth again. So uh, we probably just include that. It'd be 250 bucks for that and that. Um, no rust on the truck. You can see it's got running boards. Actually, if I remember right, the running boards, they light up. There's a little LED light. And I don't know if you can see that. Is it under, I can't remember if it's underneath. Um, oh, there's a little light strip right here. Turn the lights on. I've seen them on before. I can't remember how they go on. Open that other door. Now I can't remember how they go on. Are the headlights on? Huh? Yes. Yeah. I don't know. That one's not lighting up. I'll look on the other side. Um, but that lights up red uh, there. Sorry it took me so long I thought I was going to just turn them on. You can see it's got some fancy mud flaps here. You know out of all the rigs I've ever owned I've never had uh, the girls on the mud flaps before but now we've got four. Um, we do have the uh, um, tailgate for it and it's it's mint. Canopy is unlimited. This is actually a really nice canopy in general. It also has a bed liner inside and carpet uh, kit. Um, you can see carpet mat, bed's nice. So when it stays nice and dry uh, in here, uh, it's called a bed rug. And then also a um, little light right up here. And there's a light up there. The only thing is you have to crawl up there to turn that light on. It'd be nice to have it switched back here, uh, which wouldn't be hard uh, to do um, in general. But um, you can take the canopy off and sell it if you wanted, uh, or keep it on here. Choice is yours. Uh, you can see a little bit of uh, caulking around that third brake light. Why don't we go ahead and show the lights working here? You can see the brake lights are on, or the turn sig or the what they call. Uh, marker lights, brake lights are working. We've got uh, blinkers. And you can see also the LED down there is lighting up. We got some backup lights down there. And then also reverse. There we go. We got reverse lights. Stanley's over there uh, peeing on a tree. You can see here when the reverse lights are on, this turned uh, white uh, as well. So, and you see the lights are working here uh, for the license plate. Um, so, all that's working uh, good. You'll see a, another dent right here. I can't do anything uh, about that one. Um, that will have to be repaired. Um, but overall, super nice truck. I'm going to go to the trailer real fast and then we'll I'll walk down the truck on the other side. Uh, in general. You're going to see all the photos underneath. Um, the truck's real big for my lift, so I'm not going to put it on my lift, um, but you'll see all this stuff. No, no problems underneath there. Haven't seen any leaks or anything like that. You can see it's got uh, LEDs on the uh, front of the trailer, but a couple are out right here. And right up there, there's a few out. Really nice trailer overall. 2018. All the lights. It's got all LEDs. Stainless on top as well down the sides Really nice. Like I said, it's hardly hauled any cars in general tires are basically new um, 
what's the date? 2017. Um, and they all match. Rims look really nice uh, as well. And I like the big doors on it in general. LEDs. Rear lights are working. And this light's working. Go ahead and uh, we're going to show the lights. Blinkers and stuff working. You can see the lights are working up there as well. But right there we got brake light, turn signals, left, and we got right, and then brakes. Actually do that again. There we go. One more time. Brake lights. Do your brake lights again. Okay. You can see the brake lights are on. Um, so anyways, we'll walk down this side. We're going to open the, uh, the door. A lot of stainless on this. Really nice. The only thing I didn't like that the guy did, he didn't know how to put those stripes on really straight. So he needed a little work there on that, but not that big a deal. You can take them off. If you look down the trailer, very nice. No scratches or anything down the side, except that little tiny ding there. Uh, fenders all look good in general. Nice big door here so you can get out of your car when you're, when you're in there. So it's also got a little plug-in right here. Look inside the box. It's got two newer batteries in it. Battery here, here, and it's also got a light here. And then electric jack which is nice so super nice trailer those lights actually turn on with a switch in the uh in the trailer um itself we'll look down this side not a lot of flaws down the side of the truck uh here at all he added these added chrome door handles added the chrome down on the bottom so, and that also has a uh, step right here that just pops down real easy. Running boards on this side. I'm still curious about those darn lights underneath, those LEDs. I've seen them on before. Oh, you know what? The other side is not working. So this side is, is on. So I'll look. Maybe the other one got disconnected. You can see those lights. So it lights up red um, on the bottom um, in general. The other thing I wanted to show you is, well, why I'm here, I'll turn the key on. It does have two sets of keys, one key fob. Windows work, it's got tinted windows. All that's working. I'll show you those over there real fast. AC blows cold. And that back one there, there you go. So all the windows work, no sunroof. Um, I don't know on this year if you could get that option or not, you probably could. Um, interior's nice overall, a little bit of wear on the seat, but not bad in general for the, the miles and the condition, pretty common. This here, actually you might've saw in the back of the truck, there's a, thing that sits on here so you can put your phone in it so you can just move it on and off uh, pretty easy air conditioning works tape CD there's the miles 149 162 floors all look good tiny bit of staining on the floor but nothing major uh, in general all the door jams look good memory seats heated seats as well I'll just show you the back here The seats in the back, I don't think have had anyone in them. Uh, older guy owned it, and I don't think he had any kids, so rear seats are mint. Headliner is perfect in the truck overall. I'm probably not gonna do a driving video with the truck and trailer. Um, it does pull like a dream, like I said. It's just hard to get it out and turn around and stuff. I don't know, maybe I'll change my mind, but uh, Obviously, we'll have it running, show it underneath the hood uh, and, and everything. So, um, 
I'll, uh, I'm gonna start it up real fast so you can see the, there's no check engine lights or anything like that. Um, attitude CTS, and then it shows your uh, mileage and everything, let it set up uh, there, it's loading, main menu. I don't know how this all works uh, in general, um, but you can see juice control, diagnostics, options, hot unlocker. So um, some of you guys on the site will probably know uh, more about that than me. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you underneath the hood real fast. Underneath the hood is really clean. You can see it's got a cold air intake, an air raid. You know, but underneath the hood looks really nice uh, in general. Not rusty, no damage, not hit up here or anything like that. Actually, really clean. Uh, lights working up here. No rust underneath the hood up here on the edge. So, go ahead and rev it up a little bit. You know, this thing is just a pulling machine. I mean, when I had my X5 in the trailer and pulling this thing, I didn't even know it was there. And I pull a lot of rigs. Uh, go ahead and turn the AC on real fast. You can see the clutch is working. You know, no issues there uh, in general. So, fairly new batteries up here. Uh, as well, this one over there and here. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you the trailer real fast inside. Um, <clears throat> we do have a spare tire. When you were looking at the photos in the uh, auction, you didn't see the spare tire uh, there, but I put it in here. So just wanted to show you. There's Stanley. He's liking the trailer. Um, Really nice here, nice ramp. You can see here it's got diamond plate underneath. But nice floor and everything like that. A little bit of red paint uh, right here. Um, I tried to get it off, probably work at it a little bit more. You can probably, probably get it. But super nice floor, no wear or anything like that. And you can tell this thing hasn't hauled a lot of uh, cars at all, so. No dings or scratches inside. Spare tire. You can see here the spare tire for the truck is here. This is the tailgate. And this is the uh, mat that goes on the tailgate as well. All the cabinets and everything up here, toolbox, radio. You know, it is a 2018, so there's really not any uh, leaks going on or anything like that. Uh, I'll just show you all the cabinets open and stuff. So the roof looks really good. And I like the LEDs on the ceiling. You can see they just turn on right here. And this one turns on those blue lights that I was talking about. There's the door open. So super nice in here in general. Plenty of cabinets. Those are the uh, for the bars, leveling bars for the hitch, so everything comes with it. It's got a Warren 4000 winch. It's never been used. Fire extinguisher. And then you also have some drawers right here. There's a couple other little extra things. These are actually nice drawers. They're all wood. So pretty clean in general the floor right here came up just a little bit um, so it's kind of been re-glued uh, down there was a transmission leak in here and some of the fluid came down here and got underneath there and let it lift up so just wanted to let you be aware uh, there but overall really 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 nice trailer um, it's got speakers in the ceiling as well 
uh, four of them, one, two, three, four. So again, this is a nice package for somebody and if you don't want to keep the whole thing together, you can sell it. Uh, the, you can sell the truck off, you can sell the trailer off, you can sell the canopy off, whatever you like. Um, so it is no reserve. Top bid is going to get it. And if you got questions, give me a jingle. If you uh, want to make comments, make comments. And if you want to send a friend over to take a peek at it, we would love you uh, to do that as well. So anyways, have a great day and good luck. Adios. actually a prodigy I actually have the same one uh, in my truck in general so anyways I just wanted to do a little uh, driving video in general you know it is 4x4 four four. there's a couple little switches over there the PIA switch is uh, right there you can see right there for the lights uh, and the one right next to it was for the uh, reverse light so hopefully that gives you a good idea of it in general also in here you got your RPO codes as well we'll take a picture of that for you so Enjoy the ride, uh, we'll show you some more stuff. <laughs> 